That is so nice. Hey, I'm glad you're here. I hope all is well. Today I'm gonna to share with you a couple things that I use every day in my private practice that are really helpful. But there are things that are quite odd. You never would probably imagine that I use them. But I do wanna share them with you today because I think they'll be helpful for you as well. So let's just jump right into it. So the first oddity I use is this weird bendy arm type thing. It was originally made for a GoPro and that's why I bought it, but I'm obviously not using a GoPro in my private practice. It did come with this quarter 20 adapter and that's the size of the screw, I think on the bottom of most cameras. And when I saw that adapter, I was like, oh wow, I can actually use this for more than just my GoPro. So I actually use it to attach my microphone to. And if you didn't know, my microphone is actually attached to my desk right down below. It's actually attached to the leg with this clip bendy arm type thing, which gives me really good audio. Now, I also realize you can attach a phone to this. You can attach a light to this. This can actually become a really, really useful tool in private practice. And if you're really being creative, you can attach your phone to this, clip it somewhere, and use your phone as like a third screen. So you can have your simple practice app or another app open on your phone and have that attached maybe to a table next to you or I don't know, some anywhere really. You can even put an iPad on this probably. It's pretty strong, holds a good amount of weight. And the best news, it's cheap. I believe this was less than 20 bucks. Anyway, I think this is a tool that is like super versatile, really cool, can be used in a whole bunch of different ways. And I would be really interested to know how you would use this tool. Go ahead and leave a comment down below. The second oddity I use every day is a paper lantern. Now you might be thinking like, what is a paper lantern? And why are you using one in private practice? Well, a paper lantern is a very cheap way to get good high quality light. And when we have high quality light, our virtual sessions or virtual meetings are really improved. Now, there's different solutions out there for light. You can get lamps and ring lights and high quality like studio lights, all sorts of things. But a paper lantern, it appeals to me because it's one, very, very cheap, and two, it's disposable, it's paper. If it rips, you can just throw it out. You can fold it up and collapse it. You can easily buy a new one. It's just like super easy to deal with, not a big deal if it breaks. So I really like it. Also, it's actually right here. The, the thing about the paper lantern is that it's uh, round, it's obviously round, well, it's not obvious, but it's round. And so it actually disperses light everywhere, which gives you a nice bright scene. It's not just like a laser beam at your face, which can look a little bit weird, but it actually lights pretty much everything around you. So I use this every day to light my virtual sessions. It works really, really well, super cheap. It looks really good. And this final oddity I've pointed out several times now, but it is this right here, my pen. But not just the pen, it's also this stand that it comes with. I, I don't, I guess it's a, I don't know. It's, it might seem over the top, but something like this, although really simple and might seem like why, like this is not, you know, I don't know, 1800, it's not a quill pen. But it's actually, it's designed to be the equivalent, I guess a modern day quill pen. This is made by Grove Made, by the way. Um, anyway, why is this so helpful? Well, it's really helpful actually, because I used to have like a, a jar of pens and they would die and I would fish for them. And it was just pens were everywhere. But because I have this pen and it's super accessible, I literally just have to pick it up and write and then put it back. You would not believe how much easier this makes writing things down. I know I've talked about weird things in the past on this channel about you know little things that make a big difference, but, but truly having a pen that sticks up like this is like a game changer. I didn't think it would be. When I first bought this, I was like, ah, that might be a bit excessive. But now that I have it, I'm really glad I do. I kid you not, having this pen stick up out of the desk makes my life so much easier, makes me more productive and more efficient. I know that sounds weird. Is this gonna make me like, I don't know, the, the most productive human on the planet? No, but it's the little things that help. Not to mention, it looks really nice. I like the way it looks. I like the way it's situated on the desk. So to enjoy something like that makes it even better. So those are three oddities that I use every single day that make a huge difference in my overall workflow. Now we are all unique and have our own sense of style. So I would love to know, and I'm sure everyone else would love to know, if there's something that you use that's a bit unusual or odd that really helps you out. If you have something like that, 
please share it with us. Put it down below in the comments. But until then, I look forward to seeing you soon.